Mm. Lekka. My coffee? Failure to issue verbal response to an order. One count. You also dripped on your coat. Improper care of uniform. One count. Mm. I adore cookies. How about you, Hebra? I prefer crackers. Of course you do. You are an aberration. My colleagues say you have a focus problem, but there's no such thing. Anyone can focus if motivated properly. My feet! Oh, too hard! Excessive use of force, one count. Oh, not good. Anyone can be motivated, it seems, but you. Normal recompenses of no interest to you? Everyone in the world loves cookies, but you prefer crackers. If you insist on being different, fine. We will motivate you differently. My shoe. On my foot! Get up. This is a list of errands I need completed by the end of the day. There are no rewards for completing it, however, failure to complete it will earn you one count of obstructing court proceedings. Claw? Claw. One count? General disregard for protocol? Ten counts! Inspector, Inspector Wilhelm. <laughs> uh, good afternoon. I hope all is well. I am his inspector, not yours, Herr Carr. You have not a fear from me. So, you'll believe me when I say that I did not kidnap this girl. She followed me here on her own. Shut it's gross and I hate it. Oh, you aren't allowed to travel in the city by yourself. This will result in a spanking. Hebra? Ah, 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 ah. Was she being followed here, Carl? Uh, not as far as I could tell, no. Here's that, Hebra? Hey, Carl, pay attention to his surroundings. You can learn from his example. Even still, I must perform a security check for the entire neighborhood. So maybe malefactors laying in wait for my daughter. Herr Fryer, you are in charge of Shotzi until I return. You will give her everything she wants and see to it that she is comfortable and entertained. But, Frau Wilhelm, I cannot stay. Your errands require me. Arguing with the superior! <laughs> One count! I will not discuss the consequences for failure because she will be happy and safe when I return. Claw? Kla, I, I mean, yes, ma'am, it would be my pleasure to watch your daughter make herself comfortable. She's 14, you disgusting pig. If you so much as breeze on her, I will have you sent to the penal colony. Bis später. Have you ever babysat before? I spoke to a child on the phone once. Foul. Touching you. Would you like to watch a movie? We can rent Josephine the Singer. Ew, I hate that movie. It's a classic, Shotzi, a classic. Judging you. Okay, just tell us what you want, and we'll get it for you. I'm hungry. Oh, great, easy. Just stay right there, scowl, and we'll get you a snack. Dear Lord, Hans, are you really going to let your inspector jerk you around like this? Frau Wilhelm's approach may be more hands-on than my own, but training and focus and self-discipline will not only benefit us, but the entire inferior court of German affairs. You know it's interior, right? Isn't everything, Mr. K? Life is what you make of it, after all. As harsh as Frau Wilhelm's practices seem, I am outranked and discredited, so my best recourse is to rise to the occasion and let the chips fall where they may. So much touching you. Oh, uh, uh, you, you like cookies, right? Frau Wilhelm ate all the cookies. Uh, well, we, we still have crackers. They've been sitting out a while, but... Uh... Mm. 
It's blackmail, is what I'm saying. I can see why you might think that, but I believe it's actually sea salt and vinegar. No, I mean Wilhelm. She's forcing you to do her dirty work. I can assure you, I'm not doing anything dirty, Mr. Okay, Payne. Forget the chips and focus. She's abusing her power for personal gain. See where I'm going with this? I do. Mr. K? You will look after Shotzi until Fa Wilhelm returns. What? You can't do that. Arguing with a superior, one counts. You're not my superior. Two counts. I don't know the first thing about children, let alone girls. I sympathize, but this list of errands Paul Wilhelm left will not complete itself until I can find a way to make it do that. I'm sure you will make out just fine with the girl. What if she chokes on something? Can I touch her? Is she considered a child or an adult? Which one would be worse? Hans? Hans! Sorry. <laughs> For what? No one's done anything bad here. For the way I was acting. I don't feel comfortable around your inspector. He's weird and gross. He makes me act strangely too. I never even offered you a seat. So, you're 14. Did I hear that right? That, that you're 14? Sit with me. So, how long is your mother going to be on Hans's case? Literally. Not long, I hope. The sooner it's over, the sooner I can stop going to those weird after-school clubs with those gross kids that won't talk to me. I hate them. Uh, kids at school never used to talk to me either. It gets better. You're not weird or gross. I don't hate you. Mom doesn't either. Thanks. You wouldn't believe how nice that is to hear right now. Look, if you ever you know, want to talk about anything, just don't hesitate. Teach me to masturbate. What? <laughs> that doesn't exist. No touching, but mom says you have problems with women, so uh, you must know a lot about masturbating. Uh, that's simply not true. <laughs> did, did she read that off a file? Or? Come on, all the kids at school are doing it. I need to know how. What about your mother? She won't teach me, I've asked. I just don't... I, I, I don't... Mom said to give me whatever I wanted. Now teach me to masturbate. Teach me or I'll hurt myself. Okay, okay, I'll, I'll get someone to teach you. Where do you keep your knife? Ah! Anya. Anya. I'm not interested in you. Go away. Anya, there's ah! a teenage girl having a conniption fit in my apartment, and I can't do a thing for her. She needs a... A female touch. Oh, trying to get me to play house? A fake daughter for your fake five? I mean, that was a mistake. I should have never told my father we were married. I'll tell him the truth. It's not him that needs to be told. Uh, I thought that in some world you were attracted to me. So imagine how it must feel to be deceived and disrespected by you time and time again. Aren't you attracted to me because you think I'm a criminal? Anya? I like criminals, not assholes. I'll see what I can do. If she only has you to care for her, she must be in absolutely dire straits. Shotzi, someone's here to see you. Could we have some privacy, please? Shotzi, can we talk? Okay.
can come back in now. We had some girl talk. She's fine. I don't know how to thank you. No thanks are necessary, but if you want to do us both a favor, you should go back to thinking of me as a neighbor only. Keep your father under the impression that we are married if you wish, but don't ask me to see him, or you for that matter, outside of this hall, okay? I... Okay. My love, everything you say now. Did you enjoy your afternoon with Herr Carr? Hmm? Yeah? Feeling dunk, Herr Carr. I was appalled to learn that Herr Fryer abandoned his post. But you clearly have a fine head on your shoulders. Your appeal ought to go splendidly. Thanks. Uh, what's an appeal? The inquiry into your petition is closed. You will meet with your examining magistrate in two days' time to review the court findings and make your case for a deferral. Your inspector should have notified you of this eight days ago. In retrospect, when I informed Mr. K of his appointment, he did seem quite preoccupied with sleeping. Failure to perform order number two duties? One count! <laughs> uh, that's funny. Number two duties. Well done. <laughs> Do the rest of you fail to see the humor? Perhaps a live demonstration. <laughs>